Hi, Coach Wallen here with Indiana University Women's Golf. My answer to the COVID-19, pretty simple. Let's work on your putting. Now putting, the fundamentals of putting are gonna be really easy. We're gonna attack two of them today, which is gonna be path and face angle. And that's really easy to do if you have tools like these, which is a putting plane and teacher clips, but pretty much no one has those hanging around. So instead, we're gonna use household tools. A Band-Aid and a broom. Okay, you know, when we're working on path, there's a couple of things that we really have to pay attention to. Number one is the putter itself. Uh, the length of the putter and the lie angle are very, very important. And over the course of years, I've seen uh, most people actually use putters that are way too long for them. Uh, I use a standard 34 inch, I'm a six foot person, so that's kind of gives you a good guide. Uh, and we want to make sure that your eyes are over the golf ball. Those are two things that help keep your path going straight. Now, in order to do that, you're probably going to need some help. I've enlisted my uh, big helper here, Bo Wallman. Hi. And we're just going to go back here, and we're going to make sure our eyes are over the golf ball. And he's going to hold this so that the, the pole is directly over the golf ball and right over my eyes. That makes sure that we have a good path and we're not standing too far away. If you're standing too far away, then the putter is going to swing more around your body and then it will be harder to hit the putt straight. All right, next we're going to set up our putter to kind of work on our uh, face angle and impact point. Uh, we want to do this and we're going to do this with band-aids and, and the golf ball. So having the golf ball kind of centered on the club face, what we're going to do is we're going to put on a band-aid, thanks Bo, and we're just going to kind of flip this thing on and put it right around the face so the golf ball would fit on there. And there you go. All right, now it's time to work on our putting. We've actually got our putter set up. You can see with the band-aids uh, for the center of the face. Uh, we're getting our track set up using our closet rods and brooms, which is how and what these things are designed for in the first place. I mean, come on, who uses a broom to clean? I mean, really, let's get, let's get real. All right, so one of the things that we're gonna make sure that we're doing is putting the ball in the center, making sure our eyes are over the ball. And if we're doing this right, we're gonna hit nothing of the closet rods. If we're standing too far away and are not doing this well, we're gonna take this in and you're gonna hear a clanking. If you hit it off center, you're going to hear it make a dead sound when it hits the band-aid. So use the band-aids, use the closet rods, make sure your eyes are over the ball, make sure that you're bending at your hips so that your arms are hanging down, and then work on your path and your face angle. I guarantee that you will have better putts when we resume golf.